Pacific. We're uh, just getting, uh, that's, uh, that's Ian Johnson there, local uh, short-handed sailor, multi hull guy, setting up the anchor for uh, Uku. Uku's about to come in here and run us over and Jesse's uh, flying the drone at the moment. I'll just move the boat a bit. Um, so it's all happening here. Beautiful morning in Tassie, Kingston Beach. That's the uh, Kingston Beach Sailing Club in there, uh, just inshore. A familiar view for those. Uh, thanks, Ian! <laughs> a familiar view for those that have been uh, following the last two entrants. Yep, and uh, uh, Uku will be uh, picking up the anchor shortly. He's got to do it all himself. The anchor's there, but that's fine under the rules and um, he'll come around, pick that anchor up, and then he's settled. Has to stay here, he's gone through the gate, has to stay for at least a minimum of 90 minutes, but I think uh, knowing Uku, he'll probably be quite happy to spend a little bit longer than that as well, so we'll get a good chance to have a, a really good chat with him and find out um, uh, what he thinks of uh, the Golden Globe so far and the adventures of uh, uh, coming through the Southern Ocean, the Indian Ocean side, which is the real challenge. Uh, some serious challenges with the weather that we've all been familiar with and um, uh, as we speak Loic is still on the ship heading towards Buenos Aires he'll be on board for another three weeks or so and he did send us a letter which is quite amazing the, um, um, uh, we, it's a long story anyway we've got the letter we've uh, just translated it and uh, it describes everything everything associated with uh, uh, being recovered uh, after that rescue once he put a hole in the boat and was dismasted so uh, look out for that we'll probably get it up uh, sometime later today because there's quite a few things that happened that we didn't know about until we got this letter from him it was scanned on the ship and then emailed to us so you'll see that coming out uh, sometime later today Uku's got a dirty bottom oh I can see that got lots of slime on the back of the boat so we'll wait until he settles and then we'll uh, we'll come over we're all gonna have to duck in a minute when uh, when we reland the drone and uh, we'll see that footage later on. I'm going to turn around here. Uh, we've got um, we've got uh, Jesse's flying the drone here I'd now. Like to stop it. Is that all right? Save the okay. So uh, yep, we're going to recover the drone. So uh, uh, everyone duck here, and we'll uh, Christoph's going to catch it. Just put that mic down, Jean Jean. Um, so I'm not sure I'm not going to use my hand, you know. Here it comes. Okay, no, Christoph's going to sacrifice his hand. Um, here it comes. We're done. We'll get this down, and hopefully it uh, stays dry. Um, it's all happening. Uku's got the boat coming in the side here at the moment. So I've got to get ready to duck just in case. Always a bit of fun. This is where you hopefully don't get a haircut, although Christoph needs a bit of a haircut. Um, whoop, looks like I'm going to get it. <laughs> Here it comes. Come on. Come on. <laughs> this is the fun parts of the GGR. Um, funny, other funny story is that uh, we've been here since 3 o'clock sitting in the car park. Um, a bit of a waiting for Uku. Yeah. Um, okay. Is We're moving around a bit, so um, not making life. Can you life chuck it in reverse? Oh. Reverse? Sounds like a bumblebee. Got it, I think. Yep, we got it. Okay. What's going on? It's right and still in the corners, Christoph. It's not stopping. Okay. We got it. Okay. And Uku missed the anchor. Turn upside down. Put upside down? Yep, okay. We got it. Um, okay. Rightio, so we might just uh, go across here the other side. <laughs> I thought I'd be oh. <laughs> So, okay. Shh, Jean Jean, quiet. People are listening. <laughs> so, um, yeah, Uku's just coming around now. And. Um, We'll get to uh, get over there and give him a, give a bit of a chat and uh, see what he's been up to. Certainly, I'm surprised he's. he's uh, I didn't see Mark Slat's boat, but that looked pretty good as well. And uh, the Annie Fowling on Uku's boat looks good. He's got slime on the transom, the same as Jean Luc. So the first three boats through the gate 
are all Rustler 36s. Uh, not sure what that says, but <laughs> certainly uh, um, they're good looking boats. Strong, reliable. Bit of discussion about uh, the boats in the GTR all being not as fast as an open 60 or something like that, uh, un uh, unable to avoid some of the weather. But nonetheless, these are as good as they get for ocean voyaging boats. There's no question about that. Uh, about seven and a half ton. Um, quite a quite good on the waterline. But one thing that uh, does happen with these boats, and this is where the hydrovane, particularly on on um, the rustlers, is good. The rudder, being a transom rudder, going right down through the back of the keel, doesn't have any forward balance at all, and that makes the helm really quite hard. Uh, it's hard work. The balance rudder is a rudder that has a little bit of forward surface area between the you know, forward of the pivot point, so it helps to uh, turn the rudder once you start it, but the rusters don't have that, and John Luke describes it as being really quite heavy. Um, and uh, it's great that he's able to lash the helm and just use the, um, the hydrovane because that's an auxiliary rudder steering system rather than a servo pendulum. But you'll notice uh, in a minute when we get back towards uh, Uku's boat, he's actually got two complete wind vanes on the back of the boat. He's got a monitor, servo pendulum system, a midship straddling the, the actual rudder on the transom while we're sitting here. Uh, oh, he's in. We might just drive over there, eh? Do you want to, do you want to, we'll just drive over there and get a bit closer. Um, get a bit closer, you'll see he's got, got the, whoops, a daisy. Okay, I'm sort of partly driving and camera and working here at the moment. Right in close around. No, 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 right around, right over there, over there. Yep. Okay, that's it. Okay, he's got the servo pendulum plus the full hydrovane there, so he's got two complete uh, wind vane systems on the back of the boat. Uh, he's keeping the monitor as a, as a backup uh, and uses the hydrovane. So he can, uh, the, the servo pendulum system actually steers through the ship's tiller and uses the ship's rudder to, to steer by. Okay, we've got the big welcome here. Rightio, we want to drive over to the boat. Um, okay, I'm gonna, you want to do that, Jesse? Yep. <coughs> we can uh, just give us a bit, okay, steer hard around that way. Hard, right, right around, right around. Um, we've got our junior recruit here steering, Jesse on one hand. This is, uh, <laughs> they do this with the Volvo cruise, don't they? <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're just going to go around here and um, really hard, yep. Really hard, we'll come up alongside. Yeah, we'll go alongside. Okay, we'll just bang into them. Okay. Probably enough there. Okay. Luke has gone down for a quick sleep. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. We're coming around here. Hello, Luke. Good to see you. <laughs> so, okay, really quick. Really quick. <laughs> well, thanks, mate. Okay, I'll shake on the hand, but we're not allowed to. Oops, where are you? So, hey, did you get any sleep? Sorry. Did you get any sleep? No. No, no sleep. Yes. <laughs> Hello. Second, uh, second uh, night. Uh. Yeah. Hang on, we'll get organised here. Right, just fine. Right there, didn't you? Okay. So, welcome to Hobart. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. James, trying to stick the mic in your mouth. No. I, <laughs> I, <laughs> I, <laughs> um, so, uh, welcome to Tassie. You happy to be here? Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, to see people, human, humans. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah. So, so what's the biggest emotion for you at the moment? Uh, yes, so I'm happy. I'm yeah. Happy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. We we got your message late, so we've been here since three o'clock. But it's not as bad as you having to sail for 120 days or 118 days or something, yeah. waiting. Exactly. <laughs> And uh, everything is uh, like you, you want, uh, you want... Uh, Absolutely. Yes. Perfect. Yes. Your timing is impeccable. <laughs> <laughs> so, so that's good to see. And the boat looks good. The boat looks re in really good condition. Yes. Yeah. Nothing seriously uh, happened. Yeah. Just, yeah. Uh, just uh, this uh, uh, 
fly away. Yeah. There. And I, I put the screws here and uh, <laughs> made some yeah. hand, handwork. They're very, very fancy handwork. <laughs> so is that the second cover or you had, did you have a spare cover or that's the... No, no, I, I repaired uh, this one. Yeah, that's a spare one. Yeah, that's cool. And, um, and so... Uh, uh, how did it go coming up last night? Did you get any sleep at all? Because you didn't get no, much the night no, before. No. Just uh, sailing, just sailing. Yeah. Um, I did uh, some, uh, you know more exactly, uh, but I think I did uh, uh, 180 or uh, 200 miles uh, per 24 hours. Yeah. That's pretty good. Yeah. 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 Can't complain about that. No. <laughs> And so, how, what about food? You look as if you've lost a bit of weight. <laughs> uh, food, uh, you, you mean? Uh, food on board. Have you been eating heaps? I reckon you've lost a bit of weight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I think I, I lose uh, some kilograms. You can see. Uh, and, yeah. And uh, definitely, I will lose more. So uh, after I, I will be like. Uh, Young, young uh, guy with six, six pack again. <laughs> 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 so the first question is: Are you still having fun? Yes, yes. Yeah. I, I think uh, it is maybe one of uh, the most important uh, things. Yeah. To, to enjoy what you do. Yeah. It's yeah. Sometimes it it, it is uh, really hard, but uh, but uh, you you have to find. Uh, good things and, and uh, good emotions and, and it's, it's not uh, easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and so when you say it's hard, like hard physically, emotionally or just technically, you know? Uh, sometimes it's, it's all this. Is, uh, but um, I'm sure that uh, it's, it's the first uh, thing uh, for solo sailing is uh, mentally. Yeah, yeah. That uh, you, you have to be uh, strong and to, to find uh, uh, this good, uh, good uh, things uh, to, to go ahead, not uh, go back or something. Yeah, yeah. And are you happy with the boat? Yes. Yeah? Oh, it's very good. Very yeah. Good. Uh, and and uh, like you, you see, uh, uh, rustlers are uh, in the first uh, <laughs> hall. But uh, but uh, you you bought uh, uh, Kevin's uh, Kevin's uh, yeah. boat. Oh. Yeah. Nobody don't uh, tell uh, about this uh, that you bought. But uh, <laughs> but uh, why you, you don't uh, buy uh, rustler? Too expensive. <laughs> oh. No, no, no. It's circ some of it's circumstance, you know. It's yeah. just having one that's that's close by. Yeah. Um, so, uh, so that's cool. And so, uh, everyone's interested. You know, we, the whole fleet's had storms. Okay. So, what about your storm tactics? What were you doing? Very differently. Uh, all conditions are different, and, and uh, you cannot uh, go every time uh, with with uh, one. Uh, uh, sail sector or something uh, so one one uh, storm i took uh, all sail sector <laughs> 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 one uh, storm i, I took uh, all sail uh, town and and uh, put uh, lines uh, out yeah how many lines what, what were you using the big ones or i i uh, have a spinnaker uh, lines and they were 30 and I, I decided to uh, same time to, to wash the <laughs> storm wash. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. Did you put your undies on as well? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's okay. So and, and uh, I put uh, four, four, uh, four, and it made a difference. Uh, it is uh, so so. Uh, somehow it uh, keeps uh, yeah, better. And yeah. maybe uh, for steering is uh, easier to steer uh, uh, down the, the wave. Yes. But uh, uh, when uh, stern uh, go, goes uh, away, then uh, maybe it's uh, not so good. Yeah. So, so different. So you didn't put a drogue out? 
No. No, just the lines. I don't have. I don't. Have you don't even have one. Yeah, yeah. And, yeah. and I, I believe. Yes, I believe. Believe. Everybody here knows, but I, I believe that uh, uh, to stop uh, too much uh, boat, it's uh, dangerous. Yeah. Yeah, I'm with you. Yes. <laughs> but you're there, I wasn't. Yes. Yeah, okay. And um, uh, and so, uh, what about your sails? Have you had any sail damage? No. No? No. Yeah? No. Uh, That's good. I, I think a uh, quite important uh, thing is uh, to keep the uh, boat, uh, not, not to press uh, the last. Uh, Too hard. And then, uh, for example, uh, uh, very dangerous for for uh, sails are uh, is, uh, wind holes. Uh, wind uh, stops waves uh, are and starting to to uh, flap and and uh, I all the time take uh, sails down and and a uh, little bit uh, you you lose some uh, time but but uh, you save your sails. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. So you've already sailed around the world before. Now you're doing it again in the Golden Globe. How 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 different does it feel? Oh, yeah. they are different. You you can can't compare. This, this are so different. Yeah. Um, and if you ask uh, uh, what I like more. Yes, they are so different. <laughs> <laughs> you, you cannot uh, com compare them. So, of course, uh, uh, like, like cruising, uh, it is much more easier. And, and, uh, but uh, to be honest, uh, uh, somehow uh, on, on my uh, new boat uh, previously, uh, I stressed uh, more than uh, now it's uh, you stressed more yes because yeah. you, you you keep your property uh, like uh, in anchorage and, and uh, everywhere you, yeah but uh, here uh, it is pure pure sailing you you just uh, um, 24 hours uh, thinking about uh, just uh, sailing uh, yeah and and your radio is working well, so describe the chat sessions to me. Not what you talk about, but how you feel when you talk to the other entrants. Entrance. Yeah, when you get on the chat session and you speak yeah. with the other yeah. sailors in the in the GGR, yeah. how do you feel? Like, what's what's it like? It is very good uh, and and needed. And uh, we have we had a very nice team. Uh, it is uh, Mark. Mark is like uh, like manager. Uh. <laughs> Why am I not surprised? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and and uh, then uh, me, Are, uh, Abilash, and uh, Gregor, and Susie. But uh, but uh, now uh, we are only three in the team: uh, Susie, Mark, and me. And uh, I feel that uh, uh, Mark needs. Uh, uh, lots of such uh, conversation and, and Susie needs uh, very much. Uh, it is not very important for me and also uh, language problem. problem. Uh, I don't uh, uh, talk so soon. But, uh, but uh, uh, it is nice and, and uh, just uh, yesterday uh, Susie said that uh, she waiting uh, when uh, we have two, two times uh, that day. She she waiting when uh, uh, she can uh, come and uh, uh, yeah 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 too true. So you can make plenty of power, which is the best thing for making power for you: the water generator, the solar panels, or engine, or what? Amazingly, amazingly, mm, it, it is enough for me uh, for solar panels. Uh, yeah. Even uh, here in the uh, southern uh, ocean, I have uh, here two solar panels and then one uh, flexible uh, what I can put uh, anywhere. Yeah, yeah. And uh, because uh, we're using uh, uh, mostly for navigation uh, lights and, and uh, for radio. Yeah. So you run your full navigation lights every day, every night? Yes, of course. Yeah, of course, yeah. of course. Yeah. Of course, uh, yeah. It is important. Uh, yeah, have you seen many ships in the Southern Ocean? No. 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 
not at all. No, yeah. no, any. Yeah. After uh, uh, Good Hope, uh, no any. Yeah, they're down there. There's about one and a half ships a day. Um, and we were lucky, of course. We got uh, one for, for Loik. Uh, when we needed a ship, there was one there and uh, a big one. Uh, I don't know how much you, we, you've got the news, but it was uh, nearly 30 me 300 metres long. It was a huge ship. Um, uh, it was a uh, Japanese-owned Philippine crew, and uh, they did a good job to get him off. And we had uh, one of the long route boats, uh, Francis, um, on Elise too, he also diverted and we we're happy about that so sad to lose a boat though um, yeah very sad how did you feel about that I mean the same as all of us I suppose but um, about the uh, like uh, yeah uh, uh, things happened yeah and and uh, uh, for everybody can uh, happen to things uh, for me for for uh, Mm, I don't uh, like to, to say nothing uh, to other but uh, yeah but uh, it can be so so uh, no comments yeah well you'd be happy to know that Tommy is uh, still doing the race he's on every day on the website <laughs> and uh, uh, on Facebook now he's recovering from his operation you know um, he'll make a full recovery but it was pretty tough but yeah he's watching very closely uh, missing it greatly and uh, <laughs> so, so yeah, that, that's another one. Um, and so uh, the uh, the Dodger looks pretty good. You got the same design as uh, as Jean Luc. So you have a tiller extension as well. You can steer from inside the the Dodger. Uh, yes. Yes. You happy with that? Like you you're not getting too wet, too cold. Exactly. I'm very happy. With it. And, yeah. And uh, it is not uh, mine. Uh, uh, Lionel uh, uh, did it or ordered it, but yeah. it is, uh, design is very good. Yeah, yeah. Um, I am very happy. Yeah, and things like your wet weather gear is okay, you know, your boots, your boots you got Crocs on. <laughs> we've I lost, a, <laughs> everyone's wearing clocks, but we've we've lost a few. <laughs> I have a special, uh, special uh, uh, foods as well, but but uh, it is uh, easier and uh, uh, very important. Uh, very po important uh, for solo sailing is uh, that you are quick. Yeah, fast. Fast. You you have to uh, go out and do, do things. Uh, if you will start to put your uh, foods on, uh, you are loser. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very good. Okay. So um, and navigations. Okay. Oh yes. Uh, you know where you are? <laughs> uh, to be honest, uh, to come here was very difficult. Yeah. Very difficult. Because uh, I think uh, uh, no ships coming from east. Mostly uh, they're coming from west. And there are, there are lighthouses. But uh, to come from east, uh, there are not uh, lighthouses and, and uh, there was not uh, moon, uh, just dark and, and, uh, and um, it was very, very hard. Yeah, yeah. Well, good to get your, good to get your films and cameras and uh, films and letters and bits and pieces and see you. Yeah. <laughs> That's a bonus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah. so, same as Matessia back in those days. And so the the mast and uh, like the gooseneck and uh, the vang fittings, everything looks good. No no problem. Yeah. Have you had to go up the mast at all to check anything? Yeah, I did already. Yeah. Two times. Two times. Yes. But, yeah. Uh, uh, to be honest, again, uh, you cannot uh, do if you, if you uh, find something, uh, you can put the rope, but uh, but. Uh, uh, you cannot um, uh, change or, or you can't change it. No. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's cool. And so the furling gears are all working fine as well. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So you're planning to do any work on the boat while you're here, like to check anything again, or maybe maybe I will uh, step uh, to to must. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Maybe. And have a look. But yep. I'm uh, so tired, so maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> maybe just have a sleep. <laughs> yeah. No, no. Uh, I think we, if we're finishing, uh, we will, I will uh, leave. Because yes. it is a uh, very good wind. Uh, 
Yeah. It was hard to get uh, here, but yes. uh, now it's uh, good to, to go. Okay. All right, well, you've got to stay 90 minutes this side of it, so you've probably got another, uh, uh, let's see, you've probably got another, uh, oh, another 45, 50 minutes or something, okay. and then you'll be ready yeah. to go. We'll tell you when to go. Yeah. Uh, we can probably keep talking that long. <laughs> so, yeah. so that's cool. Um, I see uh, you've got the boom brake. You're using the boom brake a lot for jibing and holding the, the main? It's not trustable. It, it, for me, I, I, I don't know uh, how it works. Uh, uh, sometimes uh, it uh, like works, but uh, uh, for me, it's uh, not uh, the best friend. Oh, really? So, wow. So well, we can have a chat about that. I know all about it. <laughs> when we're off camera, I'll tell you how they work. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We can give you some advice. No, yeah. Uh, how, how many rings uh, has to be? It depends on how much drag you want. You can have it all of the. You've got the all of them on. You've got three rings around. Yeah. You can, and that creates the maximum drag. Yeah. Uh, or you can just use two if you want less. But normally you just decrease or increase the friction by the tension on the line. So you loosen off a little bit. Let the main find its position. Crank it on really tight, and it'll lock the boom so it won't flop around. So it has to be uh, very dense. Yeah, you pull it up really tight and it'll hold the boom in position and stops it jibing. It, it is a very tight, but... but uh, no, you have to adjust it. You're continually adjusting it. Uh, sorry. You're continually tightening it yeah. or loosening it. Uh, you don't just leave it set. Yeah. But... but um, sometimes the boom comes uh, so... Uh, so yeah. Really, okay. So well, we'll, so we'll, we'll, uh, give you some stuff after that's cool um, so has the f any fresh food at all left on board no uh, do you like uh, I have some onions some onions oh <laughs> no I'm okay <laughs> we're okay we've got the onions so uh, what are you doing about washing clothes and stuff uh, I, I doing uh, laundry yeah yes uh, every every week uh, yeah and uh, I have uh, enough uh, fresh water uh, collecting uh, very easily uh, from boom. So from the boom. Yes. So, yeah. It's it's not problem. But uh, fresh food, yes, I have uh, two onions and and uh, it's all. That's it. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's not bad. You've been at sea for a while. Yeah. <laughs> and what about your hands? How are your hands fair holding up? Oh. Give us a look. No, Give us a look. Other side. They, they look pretty good. Yes. No big deal. No. You've had no skin coming off like the water or anything like that. Mm. Yep. That's a shot for Christoph. <laughs> Nothing. Uh, yes. Of course. Um, this kind of uh, race that uh, you, you have to keep uh, your boat and uh, you have to keep yourself. Yeah. Uh, everything is uh, important. Uh, what you're doing, uh, like uh, you have to uh, clean your uh, clean your teeth. teeth and, and, uh, <laughs> everything is uh, important. Yeah, but a couple of uh, Tapio and uh, Istvan have both had problems with teeth. Okay. Yeah, yeah, big pains and such uh, small things. Yeah. Or, or uh, you cannot uh, follow. Uh, and the hands and everything is important. Uh, yeah. 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 Yep. Yeah, true. And your engine seems okay. They're coming in okay. Yeah. I. I it, it was uh, now. Uh, uh, I used the uh, engine uh, one time uh, to to put the uh, mainsail up uh, uh, with uh, road conditions, and then uh, um, then. Uh, in Piscaya, yes. Yeah. And now. Yeah. But uh, I'm afraid uh, that uh, for Tabio it's very hard uh, to come in uh, without the uh, engine. Yeah, we've got to hope he has a good sailing day. Mark Slat sailed all the way, basically. He ran the yes. engine for about one hour, yes. that's all. Yes. Yeah, he had a good breeze, so it just depends. Yeah. Yeah. For yeah. me, it was so hard. The uh, engine was in, uh, on uh, full power and, and uh, I did uh, 1.8 uh, knots. Really? Yes. Oh, maybe the prop's got some goo on it. Maybe. Maybe the propeller, because the bottom looks clean, eh? The bottom 
Jeez. Bottom looks clean. There's one big goose barnacle down there. There's probably some good fresh food in that, but um, but the uh, yeah. Maybe it, my props uh, is uh, yeah. I, I think. Yeah, maybe the props got some uh, some some stuff on it. Anyway, yeah. Um, yeah. So that's cool. Where's your life raft now? Down below. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That's cool. And the walker log's working okay. Uh, the walker log is working okay. Yeah. yeah that's good. And uh, all your other alarms, like the AIS alarm and so on, when you, yeah, okay. It work, so. Yeah. My uh, ca cassette player doesn't work. Uh oh, yeah. no music. <laughs> <laughs> I have this uh, uh, walkie talkie or uh, uh, small uh, ones, but uh, I cannot uh, hear them uh, on sea. I need to be uh, open uh, for, for noises and, and uh, for everything. Uh, yes. Um, even I cannot uh, close the uh, close, uh, hatch. Uh, yeah, because you want to hear everything. Yes. Yeah. It is some sort of feelings or uh, something. Yeah. Have you taken much water down below? Um, uh, the wind windows are okay. But, uh, but uh, some uh, leaks are coming. Uh, I, I repaired uh, their, uh, uh, <laughs> from very professionally. But <laughs> the goo on the chain plates. <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah. From everywhere uh, coming. Uh, just uh, like uh, this uh, small uh, screw here. Yeah. And water coming. Uh, Annoying. Uh, Annoying and, and uh, everything is wet inside. And, uh, That's why I didn't buy a rustler. You know, rustlers yeah. are known to leak. Yeah. You know, after they've gone halfway around the world. And yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> uh, yeah. Susie said that uh, she spoke this uh, dry. She's dry. Yes. Yeah. I think uh, because uh, in factories they uh, took everything, everything off. Yes. Yeah. Yes. But but uh, here. Uh, Nothing done uh, or uh, such uh, yeah. things, but uh, but uh, it's um, uh, for me it's uh, very important that uh, you can uh, live in inside. Yeah, yeah. So you're pretty comfortable then, though. Yeah. Yeah. Is it is it better or worse than you thought so far? The 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 race is it better or worse than you thought when you signed on for the race? You must have had an opinion of what was going to happen. Do you think it's it's better or worse, or more fun or less fun? What I uh, want to, to do is uh, to, to see uh, so Southern uh, Ocean uh, waves, uh, huge waves, and, and I did, <laughs> and a lo lot of them. <laughs> <laughs> I remember on one phone call, uh, safety phone call, uh, advising on some weather, and I told you what was coming, and I'll never forget it. You said, "Oh shit!" <laughs> <laughs> so I guess you're getting the Southern Ocean weather. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Things are changing. Uh, uh, now, now, uh, 30 knots is a normal sailing uh, weather. Yeah, and it's heavy wind in the Southern Ocean. 30 knots in the Southern Ocean is worth 35 knots in the in the tropics. You know. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, we need to see your smile. <laughs> there he is. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, so, ha so now, literally from here on in, you're sailing home. That must feel good. Uh, you're sailing home now. Yeah. 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 Exactly. That changes. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Home coming uh, closer and closer. Right? Yes. Okay. Don't look so excited. <laughs> yeah, but uh, of course, uh, I. I'm sure that uh, what was was hard, but uh, uh, what will be uh, will be hard as well. Yeah, yeah, there's still a long way to go. Yes. Yeah, yes. yeah, stay focused. You've got to try and catch Mark. You have to catch up to Mark. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. Yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ma Mark uh, sailing all the time now. Uh, we're talking, but uh, he's do doing ma uh, miles. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's why you need to get going. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, okay. Yep, all very good. So, um, so yeah, I mean, it, it's fantastic to see. I mean, the following on the race, just to follow up, the huge following, you know, the, the numbers are growing every every week. Uh, 
Um, a lot of people inspired, a lot of, a lot of sailors learning a lot of things yeah. about the weather. Yeah. So, um, um, you know, it's uh, good to get your tweets yeah. <laughs> and uh, all your messages. <laughs> oh, Ian's leaving. <laughs> so, okay. Thank, yeah. Thanks for boy. Thank <laughs> thanks you. for boy. Ian's on his way. Um, so, yeah, we'll do. Thanks, Ian. Yep. So, um, yeah, that's uh, that saves getting the anchor out, which is kind of cool. Um, okay, so you're pretty straightforward then. No work to do on the boat now. Just go and look at the mast and uh, and then. Anything I can do on uh, on. Uh, Sitting yeah. As well. yeah. Yeah. What's the, to describe a typical day in the Southern Ocean, like your routine from from twenty four hours? What What's a typical routine? You, you know, and did you get into a routine, or you were just changing to the condition? Uh, it is routine, uh, of course, but it, it is uh, in different way uh, ways. Uh, every day is different, but uh, uh, yeah, you wake up uh, in the morning. Uh, I'm coming. Uh, uh, up uh, here, I'm saying uh, hello to my uh, staring, uh, staring. Uh, What's his uh, name? Uh, it is in in English. Is uh, yeah. mm, uh, proud, 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 proud. Yes. Okay. Yeah. And then the, he is uh, very, very proud, uh, doing uh, all the time. Uh, work uh, yeah. for me and and uh, and uh, looking uh, looking uh, sales uh, making making maybe new trim uh, starting to take uh, a position uh, take uh, some some uh, uh, lines for for sun if it is possible and and uh, make, making plans uh, and, and uh, then uh, eating and, and uh, so <laughs> cooking. Uh, cooking and, and uh, what are you usually cooking? Um, in, uh, in in the beginning, I I had uh, tins food and and uh, everything uh, such uh, kinds. But uh, now I have uh, mostly only uh, um, uh, rice. Freeze dried. Freeze dried. That must be exciting. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Yes, uh, the food is good, uh, made in Estonia uh, for for uh, Estonian tests, uh, but uh, but uh, everything uh, annoying uh, here. Uh, yeah, so. yeah. So so, um, do you want to? We can chop this around, but do you want to say something in Estonian? Explain it because you know, like in your own language for people that are. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Maybe you want to. I can't interview in Estonian, but you can just rant on as much as you like, and uh, <laughs> and then uh, come back at the end, okay? Because they they might be watching, thing. Hey, I can't understand. <laughs> so just go for it. I, I forget uh, already Estonian language. Uh, <laughs> I cannot uh, speak any uh, very much, but uh, but uh, okay. Uh, Tervitus Eesti purjetatele siit Hobartist. Minu selja taga on nüüd läbitud pool, pool sellest teekonnast ja, ja kas see oli nüüd lihtsam või kergem või, või raskem, eks aeg näitab. Aga, aga siin ma olen ja, ja ma olen tulemusega rahul, et kõik poisid ei vedanud siia välja erinevatel põhjustel kui palju mul õnne veel ees on eks aeg näitab mida veel rääkida oma oma suure unistuse näha lõuna ookeni suuri laineid ma täitsin neid ma olen näinud nüüd <laughs> hommikust õhtu nii ja, ja veel vahega runes ka et et äh, ja puudust ei tule. Äh, sain ikka päris mitu head äh, tormi, võib öelda, et isegi Lõunaukenis äh, neli korraliku tormi, mille järgi innata korraliku. No, mm, eks ellu jäämine nendes äh, oli, oli äh, piiri peal. Need, 
lained on nii kõrged ja, ja järsud ja vahutavad ja, ja, ja eks siin on ka konkreetsed näited, et kõik jahid ei pidanudki vastu ja, aga kõik, mida ma siin teen, ma naudin ja, ja mul on hea meel olla siin ja, ja mul on hea meel, et nüüd läheb tee kodu poole ja arsti näen jälle oma koduseid kallimaid ja, ja loodan tasa teha siis uue energiaga, mis praegu pere, pereelus tegemata jääb. Nii et tahakski väga tervitada kõigepealt jah, koduseid abikaasat ja, ja lapsi väiksid ja suuri ja, ja igasuguseid ja siis tervitan ka kõiki neid purjetajad ja purjetami suvilisi, kes siin mind vaatamas käivad ooaeg lõppeb saate pulgad ära panna karikat viiulisse panna ja, ja teha uue aasta plaane ja mul oleks siiralt hea meel, kui keegi võtab minu eeskuju järgi teha ja, ja osaleb mõnel, mõnel tõsisemal regatil loomulikult, et see töö, mis kodus pulkade vahel ära tehakse, see on oluline ja vajalik ja põnev ka, aga ka miks mitte ennast kuulutada natukene ka välja poole. aga igal, igal asja jaoks on oma aega nii et suur tänu ja kõige paremat ahoi ja Okay, <laughs> that's good. All right, so um, I think uh, we've covered most of it and uh, we'll uh, probably shut down now and then uh, uh, we've got uh, uh, some other hookups with your wife. She's uh, wanted to have a chat on the phone, oh. <laughs> which we can do. We've got to hold the phone, but that's it. <laughs> so, um, And then we'll uh, come back again uh, when we're ready to sail away and cover it live. I think that's about it. You happy with that? Yep, so uh, thank you very much, Riku. I'd give you a big bear hug and shake your hand, but we're not allowed to, so uh, we just have to keep staring at each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so well done to get here, and uh, um, we'll uh, we'll chat again shortly, eh? <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank you, and, and uh, thanks, oh. Don. Uh, it, it was a great idea, uh, but uh, not only idea, uh, you keeping uh, eye on, on us and uh, and uh, it is uh, support uh, w- what we really need uh, very much and and uh, and um, makes uh, makes me uh, feel more relaxed uh, in in uh, hard conditions uh, so uh, thank you for don't worry support. we're watching <laughs> yeah. we're watching yeah. and in uh, total awe at some of the things that are going on so uh, all good thanks for that yeah. okay we'll uh, see you shortly <laughs>